Putting hogs on the mob, planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body, old school for low. Purple rim, 77 cutting, black with the purple strip. So, obviously, we all know the final results. Uh, Ravens beat the Steelers by two points. Uh, one over 20. I've seen a lot of predictions. No one went over 20. So that to me shows some people be paying attention. But um, for us overall, to me, the game was, it was a good game. Um, I believe defense was going to help us win. I didn't think we was going to win this game. Um, because I was thinking we ain't going to be able to pass or run on them. But obviously, that was a huge mistake on my head. We ran all over them. They knew we was going to run, and they could not stop the run. Um, Kenny Pickett, he was, well, only I think one series, and he uh, unfortunately got injured. Um, concussion, he got a sack. Um, but for as the Ravens, Tyler Huntley, he was in for a good minute. He only had uh, 12 attempts, 8 complete, 88 yards. Um, he got sacked. Um, but one thing I cannot stand is the fact that, in my opinion, um, Greg Roman be running these dudes. Like, he be making these quarterbacks run. Lamar was already having, a, I believe, a quad injury. He had him run. Even though his uh, knee injury, um, he wasn't running. He was in the pocket. But still, all those runs, it calculates. You know, it builds up. Tyler Huntley, that's the same thing happened to him. Concussion protocol, he was running. Like, dude. Then Anthony Brown came in. Um, he, he did good to me. He did good. He wasn't asked to do too much. I believe overall the um, – the quarter, our quarterback situation there what it wasn't gonna be asked to do it was gonna be uh, asked to do much. That's good. Okay, and um, the run game. Run game was the run game was awesome. Uh, J.K. Dobbins. I did not expect him to play when they say he was off I.O. I was like, oh, okay. He could probably play next week or, um, you know, just a few snaps. That dude killed it. Uh, showing 15 carries, 120 yards, 8 yards average. And the man ain't even full. He's not even 100% yet. And he cooked them boys like that. And they couldn't stop him. Longest was 44 yards. Gus, 13 carries, 66 yards, 5, a, uh, five yards, uh, uh, five yards average. He just... Man, that right there was beautiful. That right there was beautiful. Look at, and they showed Tyler Huntley nine carries. That's exactly what I'm talking about. He has no reason to be having nine carries. Greg, I, that's why I say I. I know people play. Like, Man, ain't Greg from fault. He's calling the freaking plays. If you calling a quarterback run play, hello, and the quarterback get injured on a run play. That's your fault. You called that play. Now, if the play breaks down and the quarterback runs, get your butt out of bounds or just uh, slide. But majority, you know Greg Rome's going to call them plays where they got he has the quarterback running up the middle, and he loves to do that and make them run up the middle. And to me, that's what Rick messed up Lamar and that's what messed up Huntley in my opinion I know some people gonna be like oh, dee, dee, dee. yeah okay whatever uh huh uh, but hit the backspace I don't care um the receiving wide receiver uh, I didn't I, mm, yes mm, they, they, they wasn't there like this game was literally just for the running back for JK and Gus really cause the let me see the uh, Demarcus Robinson had 52 yards. Uh, you know, you're not going to get a lot of yards out of our wide receiving corp anyway. But um, Deshaun Jackson, 34 yards, two receptions. Now, that's a surprise because usually he just, you know, steps out. But I know he made that one good play to convert it to a first down. Mark Andrews, two receptions, 17. And then that's really where it stops. 
Yeah, that's really where it's out. Cause it says two receptions for Kenyon Drake and it with one yard. I don't even know how that works. Did he catch one and go backwards or something? I don't even know how that works. But to the All Star defense, the defense played great. They slowed down Pittsburgh's run. Now Pittsburgh did catch on our cornerbacks, but. Pickens and uh, Deontay Johnson, they they good. Like Pickens is my dude. I would, Pickens was my dude. I don't even think he'll be Pickens if he was a Raven. I know somebody said that in my uh, in my uh, chat, and I hundred percent agree. Cause Ravens would have just one. He just too much of a dog for Hobbs. Um, but yeah, but when you have good and that one that one play. Uh, Deontay Johnson caught on uh, Marlon Humphrey. I couldn't even get mad. That was just a beautiful catch because Marlon played good, even with the catches uh, Pickens got on Marlon. The coverage was good, but when you just that dude at wide receiver, it ain't that much, and Pickens is that dude over there. Once he get him, uh, Kenny, uh, Kenny uh, get, get right, they're going to be dangerous. They're going to be dangerous. But that dude got some great hands. He he didn't drop nothing. Anything came his way, he caught it. He's three for three, 78 yards. So I respect him for that. Uh, Marlon Humphrey, like I said, he did um he did good. I know he got you know caught on, but like I said, that was just good plays because he was there. It was just when you that when you that good at wide receiver, it's just like that, rookie or not. Um. But the best part of the defense, obviously, is Roquan and Pratchett Queen. They've been popping up every week now, and I don't know how to. I don't know what the Ravens gonna do. I'm gonna have to make a video on that because I don't know what the Ravens gonna do with this Roquan Smith situation. Cause they gotta pay him and Lamar. But whew, that's gonna be interesting. Now my boy Marcus Peters. I, um, I didn't see him much. But um, he did get a um, – yeah, it was supposed to be an offensive pass interference, but he got to just finish the play because I saw him, like, complaining and stuff. Like, dude, they ain't listening to you, dog. The, the refs are just really not listening. Plus, we're on their field. The refs is really not listening to you. Just keep playing and stop complaining. Like, you're not, you know – they, 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 uh, wide receivers will I, I get away with that a lot. There's so many other wide receivers that does the same thing and get away with it. And, you know, it is what it is. Just continue play until you hear that whistle. Then you can complain about it when the play is over. But make sure the play is over and you know your next assignment for the next play before you sit there and just whine about it. But, um, special teams, that's just a. Um, because even a punter didn't even mess up like old uh, Harbin did with Pittsburgh. He well, he messed that punt up, and that's that's what started. I started that. I believe J.K. Big Run was off that punt. He messed up. Yeah, I believe so. But overall, the game was good. We're on to the Browns. Um, that is going to be interesting. So we'll see how that goes. We'll see how that goes. So, um, y'all tell me what y'all think about the game. So far, it's going to be interesting with the Browns with our quarterback situation as well. So, I haven't looked up anything yet on Huntley. See what's up with that. So, hit the like, hit the subscribe, hit the share. Everybody stay safe. God bless.